Greetings everybody, my name is the Crims and welcome to this commentary series on Dixie Kong's Double Trouble or also known as Donkey Kong Country 3 Double Trouble Played and recorded on my Super Nintendo The real shit, not the emulator, the PAL version which I grew up with so this is over Yeah, it's about 20 years old soon, this game came out in 1996 so next year this game will be 20 years old, it's just insane. And it's Christmas! And th this game just screams Christmas, right? No. But uh, there is a little thing about this game which is going to fit the, all, the whole theme of Christmas. Because today is December 25th! And I'm gonna do this in uh, the Christmas way, Christmas celebration. Hope you're all having a fantastic day, we're gonna play this game and have lots of fun. So, in this menu, we're gonna pick the number 3 spot and uh, we're gonna use a couple of codes. And what you do to enter them is to push L R R L R R L R L R. Yes! And then you can input uh, some codes. Um, some of these can make the game more difficult um, and change it in some ways. And what I'm going to do is enter two of them. And the first one is going to be color. Which is just going to change the color of our conks. So we have something uh, different. Because, uh, you know, this game has a billions of commentaries. So I'm going to try my best to make it a little bit different and add my own style into the mix. And so the next one is very important for this occasion, and that is Merry. Not Merry, but Merry Christmas. Just type in Merry and and you can hear that she cries, it means that the, the code is successful. And that will change uh, some of the bonus stages to um, Christmas uh, themed. So it's going to fit this. So I'm gonna name my file the Crimsy Dude, because it fits perfectly and I like that. There we go, let's play this shit! I love this game so much, I haven't played it in about Let's see, four years? It's been four years since I played this game. So let's do it. Wrinkly Kong! Hello there! It's me, Mr. Mrs. Wrinkly Kong. I found life too hectic at school with all those naughty Kremlings pestering me all the time. If you need to save your game, Dixie, call here anytime. And I record you in progress on my new VidMe What Is It machine for you. What's it? Yeah. So there we go. Her save. And you can see a Nintendo 64 in the background. Bye bye, Dixie. Try to find one of those nice banana birds. What the fuck? Okay. So if you remember in Donkey Kong 64, Wrinkly Kong is dead and she's the one who gives you tips and all that. Uh, and in this game, she is alive and well. Uh, sometimes she's playing Nintendo 64 and sometimes she's just going up and doing some exercises. Hello, Mr. Donkey Kong. Hello there, young Dixie. My name is Basara and this is my general store. All of my brothers are scattered over these islands. Hop in and say hello if you meet them on your travels. So then, how can I be of assistance to you? Uh, so, this is how the shops will look like and this is kind of new for the series. Uh, this type of shop, but uh, the other games had shops as well. Um, so we can, we have three choices, nothing today, is that a mirror, Where? where's the shell from? So where's the shell from? The shell was found at the bottom of Lake Orangutanga and it's a pretty rare, five bear coins, it's a bargain. We don't have any! <laughs> Would like to purchase uh, this fine specimen, <laughs> yes please. Uh, you gotta be joking. Not interested? Never mind. I'm sure you, some lucky person will snap it up soon. So then I can be of assistance, uh, let's see, is that a mirror? Yes, but it's an ordinary one though, uh, it was Cranky's great grandfather's, I can let it go for less than 50 coins. Can I interest you in buying this fabulous item? You gotta be joking boy! Yeah, yeah, it's going to stay here for very long. I don't think it will! I know where to get 50 coins. And that's all for now. Hey, you can use the real last day now, Dixie, you here? You hear me?! No, <laughs> to be so extremely aggressive and I like how his eyes are like quite shut so it's like his ah Dixie fuck 
Funky man! Yo dicks, what's happening? I've set up a smoking new boat on this island. But that's not all. I've also brought your excellent cousin Kitty Kong along for the ride. Well, isn't that nice? He may be a toddler, but if you let him throw upwards, he almost reach the star, so yeah. And if you throw him, his humongous body can smash through the floor of some areas. Trust me, I've tried it myself. So we're gonna get the motorboat without asking. High five! Stealing the boat, and now we can go around in this overworld. So this is new for the series. A little bit more freedom, because in the other ones it was you go in lines, you know, from one level to the next. But in this game you can actually move around a bit. But now in the beginning we can't go very far. But we can go to this beach, I mean beach, and we can... You see what's inside the bounty beach. It's Simon Says! Look at this shit! X. B. A. X. That was way too difficult. I can't play this game anymore. So you can see the colors on our Kongs are different if you played this game before. And as you saw in the opening uh, cutscene. Playing with purple, I like purple, and Dixie fits in purple. So here's our first world, I guess? Our first, yeah, world. Lake Orangutanga. This is where we found the shell. Well, well. And here we have it, standard, uh, classic, traditional Donkey Kong. And we are at our very first stage, Lakeside Limbo. And that's the thing I like about these games, that they name the stages, like the, if there are two words, they both begin with the same letter. Uh, so with Kitty Kong, he's strong as fuck. He can pick up dicks and throw her miles away. And then we can reach these places and get some uh, items. Already got two um, extra lives. And I usually like to play with uh, Kitty Kong. Uh, because he's rolling, he's cool, he's amazing, and you just love him. But you can't use him for breaking this. You need to change character. And you do this. And you throw him on the ground, and boom, we're inside. And now we can see the Christmas theme. So if you have played this game before, this should be different to you. So the stars have been replaced with jingle bells. And the music as well. So it's fi it fits today, <laughs> December 25th, it's Christmas. <laughs> Kitty Kong, what the fuck you doing, boy? And that was our very first bonus stage. Each stage has two bonus stages and one of these uh, DK shields. You need to kill them in a creative way. This first one is pretty easy. You can't throw it like this, he will stop it. And you'll have to walk home in shame. But if you do this, it will hit him on the backside, and that's how you get the DK coins. And there's one for every level. So this um, series is probably going to be a 100% run. Uh, you're trying to get all the bonus, uh, yeah, bonus coins and uh, all the DK shields. I'm gonna try my best to do that, and we shall see. Uh, now in this game, it's actually possible to fuck. It's actually possible to get um, um, when you, you when you collect stuff, you can see the percentage complete on your file, and so 100% would typically be you know you have everything. It's you know mathematic. You have everything, but in this game, you can actually get up to 105%. And how you get that is pretty weird. You need to oh, it's they have Swedish flags. Look at that. It's like the exact same color set as the Swedish flag. So this one, they spawn randomly and you get 15 of them and you are complete with the stage. So in order to get 105%, you need to enable a cheat code that makes the game harder. And uh, one of these is, um, you spell it hard and then R, so harder. Uh, and that will um, take away a lot of um, the checkpoint barrels. No, maybe not uh, the checkpoint barrels, but uh, the DK barrels, where you get your Kong back. Oh, there is an extra life there. I can't take it. But we get a coin. And I can't even go up here. There's an extra life up here, I think. But now we can't get it, because Dixie is on vacation. And that was the first stage. And the other code, which makes the game even harder, is called Tough. Something like that. You spell it T-U-F-S-T. And that will disable every single DK barrel and every single checkpoint barrel. And that will make the game very difficult, especially if you want to get 100%. Uh, 
um, I have done that on this console. Real shit, no uh, emulator, no safe states. I've done it the real way and I'm so happy about that. It was extremely difficult, but I'm not gonna do it for this series. Um, we're just gonna do it normally with the uh, different colors and um, the Merry Christmas theme as long as, as it's uh, December because I don't think I'm gonna finish this series in December. We're nearing the end of 2015, so this might be my last series, or Pikmin might be the last one. And when you 100% the level, the flag will um, change depending on how much percentage you got, and the flag will look like this when you have 100%. The gold flag is for the DK thing, and then the green ones up and down are for the bonus coins. So it, it's going to be very obvious if you haven't completed a game, or I mean a stage, 100%. I didn't know that when I grew up, so I was kind of stupid, but uh, now I know. We're gonna try to get 100%, and I'm gonna end this first part here, everybody, so thank you very much for watching. I apologize for it being kind of uh, all over the place, I'm talking so much, explaining a lot of stuff, I'm going yeah, all over the place, so I'm sorry if it's a little bit hectic, this first part, but I want to explain and um, share as many things as I can so you know how this series is going to be. So, with that, I will see you in the next episode and we're gonna do Doorstop Dash. And have a great day and Merry Christmas, everybody.